So let's move forward, ladies and gentlemen, to the keynote address. We have in the midst of us a young Turk who is also the director of SAI State Consultants. Could we have a huge round of applause as I invite Mr. Ahmed Wadwani to deliver the keynote address? Do you want a mic? Oh, okay. Uh, hi. Very good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm always given the tough task to speak after Mr. Niganjan Higanandani, and today I'm speaking after Mr. Anubhak Bhatra. So I've got used to uh, speaking after renowned personalities. So it's nice to be in Delhi. In Mumbai, we are better known. Uh, Sai Estate Consultants in the city of Mumbai is seen on the hoardings, in print. Uh, I'm going to talk a little bit about Sai Estate Consultants because this is a new market, and I'm delighted to have a new office uh, in CP in Delhi. So I would want to also tell you how Sai Estate Consultants can add value to each one of you in this cabin. Sorry, in this uh, you know this area that uh, we have all gathered at. So Sai Estate Consultants started in the year 2010, and it was started by me. I had six years of experience of no real estate, and I used to work as a cabin crew with Jet Airways, serving tea, coffee, veg, and non-vegetarian to one alpha, Mr. Amitabh Bachchan, and 60 alpha, uh, a client who wanted only non-vegetarian and would not settle for a, uh, uh, unless I give him a piece of chicken or something to do with non-vegetarian. So that's where I learned the art of customer service. And somewhere, you know, I'm happy that I uh, uh, dropped out of college to join such a premier airline that taught me when you sell a 15, 20 rupee coffee, the consumer wants everything. The guest wants everything. And when my 200 sales guys today come back and tell me that, sir, the guy says, I'm ready to buy a flat, but I will not pay 2 lakh rupees for a car park. By the way, in Maharashtra, Gaira, we can sell car park as far as it is designated. So we charge specifically for a car park. So, you know, we tell our uh, sales guys also that uh, I have sold tea coffee at 15 rupees and uh, yet delivered the cup, landed right on the spot with a smile on my face, managed to look good, managed to s feed Bombay Baroda passengers, to 182 passengers, feed them, give them tea, coffee, take the trays back. By the time they're not even eaten, we have... The reason I'm telling you all this is because today the entire real estate industry revolves around one important factor, which is called consumer sentiments. So you can have the best product. In Mumbai, we have Lodas doing skyscrapers and looking at uh, huge apartments, great value, amazing locations, even very good prices. You know, they are known for very good prices, and I'm a big fan of the brand Loda. Uh, I don't do too much work with them because now I'm with the affordable housing. But the point is, they are great communicators. They use the media in a way. Uh, in they, cre they have created a niche for themselves. So. At this point in time, I feel consumer sentiments is the most important amenity that a consumer is looking at. If I cut out a check worth 5 lakh rupees, I am actually not wondering whether you're going to give me Italian marble or you're going to give me normal kadappa tile. That comes secondary. I first want to know ki you check lene ke baad mein bilda bhaag jayega ki nahi. Isn't it? That that is that is that is the you know the big question mark. At Sai State Consultants, we take six thousand phone calls every day. So anybody who believes that markets are sluggish and it is difficult to sell inventory in MMR, we close minimum one hundred crores deals every week, and our weekend starts on a Tuesday afternoon at two thirty. The only downtime we have is on Monday because the response is amazing. I can tell you that what we do is, is uh, I believe, is not a CSR activity, but there is great job satisfaction in doing what we do because we work with developers who offer a 30% discount. And I understand that developers are in pain and there is no money in the system, that developers are facing losses, they are also paying interest. But when once you are stuck, you have to come out of the gut. And the best way to come out and maintain liquidity is to say, okay, this is my price, this is the inventory, I'm not making any money, I made money for the last 20 years. You, you try and ask an NRI what the NRI thinks about the Indian development industry and, and the, the standards that uh, we have, uh, it will not be a very pleasant one to give you a very honest feedback. Considering that we have a new office in Marina Bay in Dubai, we get a lot of feedback, which is absolute in, in contrast to what our Indian consumers say. So the point I'm trying to make here is that this is a time where 
we have to all as a fraternity brokers bankers developers uh, you know come together and work on building sentiments if i can do great homes but i do not have the ability to tell you that i have no bad intention i will follow gaga i will give you amazing product line but i do not really convince the consumer there is no point in going in that direction and and i have been you know i have been bound by uh, my my uh, of course kpmg is also one of our knowledge partners we also work with uh, ey and we also work with uh, good ad agencies who have been i am 33 but i deal with people who have 33 years and plus of experience so i like to go with them my cmo ceo are all much older than what i am but i take their word and they all want me that यार आप एन सी आर जा रहे हो वहाँ पे तो बहुत सप्लाई है वहाँ पे तो बहुत अनसोल्ड स्टॉक है तो बी केयरफुल बिकॉज लॉर्ड ऑफ मनी हैव लॉर्ड ऑफ पीपल हैव लॉस्ट मनी एंड देव नॉट बीन एबल टू डू अ गुड जॉब आई एंटर द मार्केट इन 2010 थाउजेंड एंड टू थाउजेंड टिल टू थाउजेंड फोर्टीन uh times were not all that good but in certain pockets we had appreciation as far as investor sentiments are concerned but 2014 it's been a tough task but it's a very very exciting one one uh, uh experience i would want to share with you after 2014 we stopped communicating with all individual retail investors because dil say i believed that there is no capital appreciation in mumbai markets after 2014 and if i tell an investor sir aap ye 10000 rupees mein le lo aur main 14000 rupees mein aapko 2015 mein bech ke deta hu to aaj main yahan nahi khada hota tha my phone would have been filled with messages and whatsapp messages saying that sir aapne exit nahi diya mujhe this is the reality today people who have assets worth 500 crores have problem sending 5 10 lakh rupees of rtgs that's the ground reality because the liquid position uh, has been that way people i won't talk about gst gaga and demonetization because these are three things that being an optimist as per my study eventually will all phase out and this is for the betterment of the country and to make indian real estate to be perceived in a way which is not something you know that that will keep us down when we have a discussion in the united states talking about indian real estate and indian developers so uh, on this note uh, i i i am always my my 200 member team uh, and now uh, we are recruiting 15 to 20 people every weekend and i must tell you certain facts about sai estate consultants we buy media worth 90 crore rupees every fiscal year atl btl outdoor from times of india hindustan times midday and various other uh, places and we have chosen to be as aggressive inversely proportional to the market so as the market keeps going bad we keep pushing harder if there are four brokerage houses that have gone down because they have not really put that extra effort there was a time in 2016 i used to work 14 hours now i've gone to 18 and a half 19 hours a day because this is the time i believe this is the opportunity because there has been an organic correction in the market as far as consumers are concerned only a entire development fraternity accepts that ha mujhe thoda loss ho gaya hai is there a way i can come out of this situation let me not Uh, go to a bank and borrow at 27, 28%. Rather, give that 28, 20, 30% rated discount to the consumers, and they'll be delighted to deal with me. With such ideologies, we manage to sell multiple units in Mumbai. And though I am very comfortable uh, conducting business in MMR because we have 1 lakh 50,000 crore of unsold stock. in mmr and at my company's end we do only 5500 crores every year even if i double my capacity i will not be able to do more than 10000 crores uh, every fiscal year so i have 1 lakh 40000 crore of ocean there for me to conquer but i felt that the concept of 30 40 30 which sai estate follows where initially we tend the developer to give us a 30% discount and then there is immediate subscription because we attract we buy a lot of media talk about it whether it is digital whether it is nri whether it is exhibitions after the name is created of that specific i tell you one of the problems of most of the developers here they have some great legacy but i don't know why they have a mind 
block towards advertising and marketing. So when it comes to having a jacket on the front page, they feel that, you know, more, this is my experience. Most of the developers feel, yeah, I don't need to add anything. I have 500 crore rupees of money. Why do I advertise? So, you know, these are things that are, keep me uh, and keep me in business because we, uh, we take up such projects and take the entire advertising, marketing. Uh, and, and, and believe you me, we are a debt-free organization. I have said no to a couple of private equities who have come to me in Mumbai for my 18 to 20% shares, but we have chosen to remain debt-free because when I sign my check, I want to take my own decisions and not basis uh, an investor or a bank or a private equity who dictates terms. This is my understanding on the subject. We, look, we are looking at an IPO by 2019-20, which will be uh, India's first IPO that comes from a brokerage house which is less than 10 years old and is not backed up by any big daddy sending me US dollars or nor my daddy has left anything back for me to really uh, take off from. So uh, uh, as you guys must have uh, guessed it by now, I am an absolute optimist and we have taken MMR by storm. Uh, we are known for positive disruption and we will continue to add as much value as possible, continue to ensure that we meet our goal, which is one home for every Mumbai car. And now that I'm speaking in Delhi, I'll take the privilege to call it one home for every Indian. Uh, I thank each one of you for giving me this opportunity to be here. Thank you Thought Bubbles, who's been our ad agency. Thank you Alchemist, who's traveled with us. Thank you our PR agency, White Mark, and all my 208 uh, lovely boys and girls between 25 to 65 years who ensure that we do an amazing job every single day, 18 and a half, 19 hours. Thank you. Thank you so much, Amit, for sharing that, and uh, we wish you good luck for the IPO also coming up.